Hey, what's going on, guys? Dave the Usher here with my wife, Ty. Hello! And we're doing an unboxing. We are. As you can guess from the title, it has to do with toys. It has to do with Transformers. I'm a huge, uh, I'm a huge Transformers fan. And uh, my wife, actually, is kind of a Transformers fan, too. Kind we're, of. We're going to BotCon 2016. So excited. In about two months. And it's going to be crazy. So, uh... My ears are making noise. Can you explain these ears and why you have them? <laughs> I bought them, but why do you have them? These are Neko Mimi, and they're supposed to read your brain signals, and then your ears wiggle around. Because they're cute! Right now, we're doing an unboxing. This package is from far away. What was it? Uh, Hong Kong, man. This package is from Hong Kong. Crazy stuff. Because, well, the posting date's February 2016, like a couple months ago, there was um, a couple of Transformers figures released way over there, man. That wasn't that weren't released over here, and uh, the title probably will give it away because you know you like to have a nice title. But okay. let's what? Let's look at. Let, let's check it out. So okay. we're gonna we're gonna unbox the items. And uh, then I'm going to talk about Transformers like and bore toys. everybody. All right. Oh, look at this. Even the, the packaging's kind of different. Pulling them out. Here we go. We have uh, Transformers uh, sports car to robot. This is Nightbird. Nightbird Shadow, it says. But <laughs> it's Nightbird. That's what she says? Yeah. Nightbird is... She's a character from Generation 1, basically... Um, she's pretty awesome. She appeared in an episode in Generation 1 Transformers Season 1 where Megatron stole like a, like a Japanese robot mm -hmm. from like the Japanese government or, I don't know, a computer company or something. Yeah, you saw the episode and Star it was kind of funny. Starscream was getting all jealous and she's not so hot. Megatron was like, she's hot enough to replace you when I choose. So Ty... Nightbird here is actually a repaint of RC right here, Transformers Generations RC. But they do that a lot, right? Which, yeah, they uh, they do it a lot. You know, it's funny. Well, <laughs> they've done it in the past. They do it right now to this present day at uh, at great length. We all know the Combiner Wars. How many times can we repaint? We all know the. <laughs> yes, we well we do. Okay. We all know how many times they can repaint the same figure over and over again. But yeah, I mean, it's still pretty cool. Uh, you know, Nightbird right here. She looks great. Th this is the first time they've ever released Nightbird. I'm pretty sure I'm correct on, on saying that. Anything I say wrong, of course. I'll show you a little bit of the box art. Yeah, I mean, that's straight out of Generation 1, that uh, that depiction of her. She looks great. I mean, we can... Because here's the thing. I am not going to take them out of the boxes, so... <laughs> I'm going to show you, you know, the back so you can kind of see them transformed and all. But yeah, she looks awesome, man. All right, so there was two items in this box. And the next one right here is um, from Spider to Robot, we got Black Arachnia. Ah! Takara's Black Arachnia. That's what these, these are figures from Takara, by the way. I'm sure everyone knows that. Awesome. But this is Black Arachnia Transformers animated repaint. Also a repaint. But still very cool. And when I say repaint, that's not to say they didn't have like some alterations and like new like head sculpts done, stuff like that, you know. Mm -hmm. So there are there's like minor differences. That's good. Robot mode, man. Yeah. Ty, what do you think of Black Arachnia? I love Black Arachnia. So since we're going to uh, Botcon 2016 in a couple months, very happy. There's a certain voice actress who's going to be there. Of course. You know who it is. Black Arachnia. It's Venus Terzo. It's going to yes. be, you know, I'm a big uh, fan of meeting voice actors. I'm really yeah, It's a lot of fun, you know? So she's going to be there. Oh, I'm totally keeping this in the box. You know, I, I love getting uh, things signed. Uh, so of course you do. You know, do. by, we all by do. voice actors. It's a lot of fun. Hello, Lulu Bell. Hello. Lulu, what do you think of Black Arachnia? Do you like her? Is this, is this good? No, you're on me. So, Ty, a couple things here. This is um, the original Black Arachnia from Beast Wars. Uh, in the package, out of the package, what are, what are your thoughts on the first Black Arachnia toy ever released here? As um, you guys can see. Meh. Just meh? You know, uh, Chi was a repaint 
of Beast Wars Tarantulas yeah, in the like first almost, place. Yeah, like almost, I mean, she so, looks like Tarantulas. She, she kind of looks like Tarantulas, yeah. Of course she does. This is Transmetal 2 Black Arachnia. Yeah. So there was the repaint off of uh, Tarantulas, and then she finally did technically, she had her own uh, sculpt, her own, you know, her own body here. So, I mean, thoughts on this one? Uh, a little bit better. Transmetal 2 Black Arachnia. Yeah. All the fans, especially Beast War fans, were super psyched about this release because it's like true up till now and they've been doing this a lot recently with like transformers generations i got like rat trap and rhinox around here and you know there's like a newer dinobot new newer cheetor whatever uh but yeah they've been doing it and <laughs> she looks uh, a hell of a lot better i would say she looks more show accurate it's what it's all about now show accuracy man mm -hmm. slipstream right here who is your favorite decepticon i actually purchased this for ty for christmas i'm very happy yeah because ty is a huge slipstream fan yeah Buka. this is uh what was it the transformers collectors club uh slipstream exclusive that came out a little while ago and that was the first uh i believe that was the first slipstream toy transformers toy ever released followed by this one. Now, unfortunately, that is not an original mold, I know. nor is this one. That is uh, a repaint of Transformers Prime Starscream. This one right here that just came out recently is is a repaint of, uh, hello, you know who this is? Wind something. Uh, wind, wind, blade, wind Razor. I, I can't even remember myself. <laughs> wind Razor. You got Air Razor. Air Razor, Wind Razor, Wind Blade. But, uh, yeah, repaint right here. So you can kind of see the mold yeah. of what she would look like. Mm -hmm. But a different uh, head, you were saying? Uh, yeah, yeah. You know, they all have, like, a little bit a little bit of differences, alterations and stuff like that. So, guys, I just wanted to do a quick unboxing, show you a couple of things that just came in the mail recently because, you know, why not? You know, it's fun to share. And, uh, yeah, good stuff, guys. Um, you know, if you are a Transformers collector yourself, uh, you know, give me your comments, it, it, especially if you purchase these three latest releases from Takara, you know, the, uh, the three ladies here, Nightbird, Black Arachnia, and uh, Slipstream. If you've made purchases of these three, um, show us, you know, leave us your comments, let us know what you think, opinions, thoughts on them, you know, are they a disappointment, are they like... You know, are they awesome? Mm -hmm. Expectations fulfilled, you know, because you guys, I'm sure, are collectors. Some of you, at least, yourselves. And, uh, yeah, guys, awesome stuff, Ty. What do you think? Um, I'm very happy with them. I think they are great. There you go. So, guys, thanks for watching. And uh, links to social media and stuff are in the video description below. I'm Dave the Usher with my wife, Ty. And Hello. we'll see you. Bye.